It is totally possible to save even more than $1,000 monthly in a very simple way. A strong relationship exists between being healthy and wealthy, as each can positively influence the other. Health and wealth are interconnected in various ways, including productivity, healthcare costs, and quality of life. The modern world has become a breeding ground for various weight loss products and services, with the industry amassing billions of dollars in revenue. Meanwhile, the population is becoming increasingly overweight and unhealthy. By adopting a healthier lifestyle, you can save hundreds of dollars per month on unnecessary weight loss products and medications while also improving your productivity and overall well-being. Hi, I am Rob from Explaining Health. Every week I want to share my medical knowledge. The global weight loss and weight management market size was valued at $224.27 billion in 2021 and is expected to surpass $405.4 billion by 2030. According to Harvard School of Public Health, two out of three U.S. adults are overweight or obese. 69% and one out of three are obese. 36% Obesity rates have more than doubled since 1980. The cost of weight loss products and services can amount to hundreds of dollars per month for individuals seeking to lose weight. For example, unfortunately people use a well-known medication for weight loss, but it is a drug for diabetes treatment. If you know the name, say in the comments below. The monthly cost of this drug may reach almost $900 per month. As Warren Buffett stated, the rule number one to be wealthy is never lose money, and the rule number two is never forget the rule number one. So you understand. Subscribe to get more informative videos. Now, things get even worse, with promises of miracle supplements. Over the years, numerous products have been marketed as miracle solutions to obesity, promising fast weight loss results with minimal effort. These products often capitalize on the desire for a quick fix, and are usually not supported by scientific evidence or is based on fake science. Why do so many people still get deceived? Because of the mental triggers. Mental triggers are psychological factors that influence consumer behavior, often driving them to make decisions based on emotions or cognitive shortcuts. When it comes to fake or ineffective weight loss products, several mental triggers come into play. These triggers can lead people to buy these products despite the lack of scientific evidence or proven results. Some key mental triggers related to fake weight loss products include 1. The desire for quick results The promise of rapid weight loss can be a powerful mental trigger as many people want immediate results with minimal effort. Fake weight loss products often capitalize on this desire by making unrealistic claims about the speed and ease of weight loss. 2. Social proof People tend to follow the actions of others, believing that if many people are using a product, it must be effective. Unfortunately, many social proofs are provided by paid actors to persuade you into buying a product that they claim is incredible, even though they have never used it. Fake weight loss products may use testimonials, celebrity endorsements, or manipulated before and after photos to create an illusion of social proof convincing potential buyers that the product works. 3. Authority bias. Consumers are more likely to trust products endorsed by perceived experts or authority figures. Fake weight loss products may use fabricated endorsements from doctors, nutritionists, or other professionals to create a sense of credibility and legitimacy. 4. Scarcity. The perception of limited availability can create a sense of urgency prompting consumers to act quickly for fear of missing out. Fake weight loss products may use tactics like limited time offers, countdown timers, or claims of low stock to create an artificial sense of scarcity. 5. Loss aversion. People tend to be more motivated by the fear of losing something than the prospect of gaining something of equal value. Fake weight loss products may emphasize the negative consequences of not using their product such as missing out on an opportunity to lose weight quickly and easily. 6. Emotional Appeal Weight loss is an emotional topic for many people, and fake weight loss products may exploit these emotions by promising to boost self-esteem, improve relationships, or increase happiness. By appealing to emotions, 
these products can create a strong desire in consumers to believe in their effectiveness. If you like this kind of content, leave a thumbs up. The truth is, a magic pill against obesity is unlikely to exist. If it did, it would indeed make headlines, win prestigious awards, and change the world as we know it. But until that day comes, we must rely on tried and true methods of weight loss, such as a healthy diet, regular exercise, and sustainable lifestyle changes. The second way to save money by being healthy is because your productivity depends directly on how healthy you are. In a study from 2002, the researchers aimed to examine the effects of obesity, smoking, and problem drinking on healthcare utilization and costs. The data used in the study were derived from the 1987 National Medical Expenditure Survey NMES and its 1996 follow-up survey. The researchers found that obesity significantly increased healthcare costs and decreased productivity due to increased absenteeism and presenteeism reduced on the job productivity. Obese workers were found to have higher rates of disability, which in turn affected their earning potential. The study also found that the annual health care costs for obese individuals were 36% higher than those for people with normal weight. The third way to save money by being healthy is spending less money in medications by embracing a healthy lifestyle. Unhealthy individuals often spend hundreds of dollars per month on medications to manage chronic conditions related to their lifestyle, such as high blood pressure, diabetes, and heart disease. A study from the American Journal of Preventive Medicine from 2019 shows this. In this study, the researchers aim to determine the medical costs associated with the low fitness physic among active duty U.S. Air Force personnel. They analyzed data from 46,000 334 personnel who had completed a fitness assessment between 2009 and 2012. The results of the study showed that individuals with a low fitness physic had higher medical costs than their counterparts with a high fitness physic. The researchers found that the average annual medical costs for personnel with a low fitness physic were $1,428 while the average annual medical costs for personnel with a high fitness physic were $1,041. This difference indicates the potential cost savings of $387 per person per year by maintaining a high fitness physic. Although this study focuses specifically on U.S. Air Force personnel, it highlights the potential cost savings associated with maintaining a healthy lifestyle. By adopting healthier habits, such as regular exercise and a balanced diet, individuals can potentially save money on medical expenses, including medications. A great way to save money with medications is by unlocking the surprising foods that can lower your blood pressure here at this video.